Hello, good morning everyone. My name is RC and you're watching Recapture. I've never done that intro. Anyways, good morning everyone. I hope you are all doing well. Sincerely, I do hope you're doing well because I'm not. I am currently sick. Right now, I have the um, COVID virus, uh, probably the Omicron um, variant. So um, I'm just staying at home, self-isolating. So I'm doing a vlog just because uh, I've been wanting to do <coughs> like a reading vlog, but I haven't been doing it. I, I am still reading, but I haven't been doing a reading vlog, so maybe today is the time to start doing that. So I keep coughing and it's just, it's just so bad, honestly, like my symptoms are not even like this severe symptoms, but still, you know, it's just not very nice being sick. So today is Wednesday. 4th of May. I just woke up like uh, maybe like 10-20 minutes ago. I haven't eaten breakfast so I'm about to eat right now. I'm eating inside my room. I don't usually eat my room. I try not to. Like, I drink hot coffee. I drink tea and stuff. You know, hot drinks in my room but I rarely eat in my room. Just because I don't know it's cleaner that way but because I'm self-isolating I just have to you know, do everything in my room except relieving myself obviously the plan for today is eat and then read and then rest and get better so my mom brought me some strawberries and blueberries and these are some um, meds and um, vitamin supplements that I didn't finish actually yesterday. So I still have to take these. And then I have warm milk right here and a glass of water. Well, it's empty. Get it. Joe Kawaii. I gotta get some cheese. Let's get it. Showboy! 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 Wow! Wow! Good morning! Good morning! Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. here he hasn't been sleeping in my room because I'm sick I will not I will not do not talk I'm sitting on my dog's bed. He's not here with me. Because I'm sick and we don't know if dogs get COVID as well. 
but we don't want to risk it. So, yes, mother. Yeah. What? Like a like a blanca. Okay, good luck. <coughs> Why were you knocking? She said good luck. This is the fix. Vapor rub. <sighs> I need all the menthol, minty things <coughs> in the world to help with this cough and COVID in general. steak with truffle cheese and some blue cheese um, I have my um, blueberry goat cheese here so this will be my lunch I actually haven't made any content for a month like the entire month of April or like probably more than a month because um, we we're just really busy and then after being busy now we're sick so it's just me and my family and I it's not just me I just wasn't able to it's not that i wasn't able when i was busy it's just making content wasn't really my priority per, blah, 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 my priority but then when i was no longer busy obviously i got hit by covid i did plan to make some new videos like spring cleaning um like series but i didn't get to do that and i wanted to also like properly introduce um cell bite um to the viewers of my channel but right now i can't i can't really do that although i did already create a new channel for cell bite um, just so I can like kind of upload videos for him but kind of keep it separate from my channel although I will have like um, videos featuring him I wanted to bring my dog to um, the tulip festival it's a yearly thing that um, people here the locals go to and visit and they take pictures and all that and I wanted to bring him <coughs> I wanted to bring him there but obviously we got sick so we couldn't go and well we I guess we could go if we wanted to but obviously we didn't because we have the COVID and we don't want to go there and be the I don't know harbinger of the dark virus Sure didn't go. So hopefully next year we'll get to go because the chalk field is like really really nice. <sighs> Let me just get some more. Got more steak because I love it. It's it's good. Anyway, I forgot what I was saying. 
today I was talking about the tulip field. Hopefully we'll get to go next year. Hopefully I can also visit the tulip field with not just Chobai. But also my man, yes. Hopefully, I just rested because my throat hurts so much. It hurts so much. It feels like sandpaper. Whatever I cough. I'm going to take a beat in cough control. In Canada, they call this um robitussin but i'm just like i just feel, like feel it sounds weird to me because um i grew up hearing robitussin and not robitussin so that's what it is so i took um dayquil um in the morning depression meds because i'm depressed and these medicines. I don't really know what they do. Um, I guess they just they help me. I don't know what to stay alive. Maybe I don't know. Anyways, and then I have my um, vitamin D. Cordyceps, cordyceps, and lion's mane, lion's mane. They have spirulina, spirulina, and spirulina. These are like um, supplements for good health and good immunity and all that. These are like for AM and I have one for PM too. This is turmeric um, for inflammation. <laughs> so now I'm going to be resting while listening to an audiobook in bed. But before I do that, let me show you what I have um, for my like uh, sick uh, like clot essentials. So I have my tray here. Um, as you can see, I was eating my uh, blueberries, uh, I have strawberries, and then I have just like disposable um, forks. They're disposable, but like I keep washing them. So, uh, and then I have Pocky sticks here, different flavors. Then I have Ensure. Um, for meal uh, replacement, just in case I don't have an appetite, um, I drink this thing. And then mandarins right here for um, you know extra vitamins. And then they have the Sky Flakes um, crackers. This one's the onion and chives flavor is one of my favorite and I also like the blue one which is like the condensed milk flavor I believe and then this one is like the original um original flavor so yeah I did not finish that one last night and then I just have um water bottles right here these are like already open I just keep like putting um refilling it with water and they have the um, mini um, cookies right here. Um, and I just like put more snacks and stuff for now. I don't usually have food in my room, but 
right now it's different because um, I need to stay in my room like the whole day so I just I want to have food in me because I love food and then over here this little tray I have my um, medicines uh, vitamins supplements and all of that um, I have like the a.m. and then the p.m. and then I have um, what is this the uh, hand sanitizer gel this is like just a normal like one like you know how it smells and then this one is the vanilla coconut um, sanitizer gel and then they have the Halls um, cough drops um, they're very <coughs> excuse me helpful and then I have Gaviscon um, this is focus brother focus 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 there <laughs> this is for um, when I feel like I'm gonna puke or something and then I have the Vicks Vapor Rub right here that I rub on my chest and my throat and my back. And then I have the Salon Pass right here that I put on my chest and my throat as well. Um, it says it's for muscle pains, whatever, but I put it on my throat, like because and my neck basically, not 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 inside, obviously. Because it's like very like um, mentally like minty, you know, so I like it. And then I have my combo Jessic right here. It's um, a combination of acetaminophen and ibuprofen. Um, so I have that. And then I also take NyQuil, which you can kind of see here. Like that's the orange one. That's DayQuil actually. And then the NyQuil is like the the green one that's in the PM um, that one has cough suppressants and antihistamine and then it uh, also has acetaminophen 325 milligrams and this one has acetaminophen 325 milligrams so I just have to kind of like make sure I don't take too much acetaminophen in within 24 hours and it has 97 I think something like that um 97.5 milligrams of ibuprofen because I also take this so I, I just have to kind of take note this one is I call it Advil but this is actually just a Kirkland ibuprofen li liquid gel um liquid gel but I'm just so used to the Advil liquid gel um they are 200 milligrams where is it 200 milligrams 250 capsules so i have that I just take them in you know moderation obviously i don't take them all at the same time and i make sure to just you know measure them and you know you know what i mean i can't talk anymore and i have my thermometer right here um to check my temperature I have another hand sanitizer spray then I have my big water bottle this is like almost two liters um, and I really like it this is gigantic like it's huge two liters bro um, but I love it because um, I don't like running out of water so I bought like the gigantic water bottle I have my glasses in case I need to see and then I have this um, magic heat pack I don't know why Dr. Ho decided to call it magic magic heat pack because it's not magic it's it's science but um, this is like the thing where you click the coin inside and then it just kind of like crystallizes and it emits heat so it's really nice I lost my um, hot water bottle I don't know where I put it so I've been using this one I put my hot milk here or hot tea here then use my um, water and then I have um, hand uh, no it's not hand sanitizing but like uh, sanitizing excuse me sanitizing 
wipes there you go wipes sanitizing wipes to just you know like clean stuff and then they have like this um paper towel um again for like to keep things clean and all of that and then i have this <laughs> i have this on my bookshelf right now um the clorox disinfecting wipes i don't know if this has okay no it doesn't have bleach so that's what i have and let me just show you because i bought this um i bought this one um last week this is um gallant by v schwab i just saw it's 30 percent off so i'm like you know what let's uh, buy it because it's been on my wish list but um yeah it's just you know it says 30 percent off so there you go my bookshelves are not very organized right now um but it's okay because like the rest of me isn't organized either and then on my nightstand i have the rabbit test um this thing belongs in here and this was my um positive test um this is free um you just go to the pharmacy and they give this to you so there you go and on my other nightstand i have this box of um kleenex soothing lotion with aloe vera and coconut oil this is like my second box in a couple of days on my doorknob here i have a mask so i don't forget to put it on before i go out of my room oh and before i forget i also have some candies in here so i have rockets and then i have the xo um coffee candy is one of my favorite candies ever and then i have my humidifier right here beside my bed so i don't get a dry throat because it hurts already and when it's dry it hurts even more it feels like sandpaper so this is just very helpful and then <coughs> excuse me i have my handkerchief <laughs> this is so funny i can't even talk i have my handkerchief right here um vaseline i have my white flower i put like a drop or two on my handkerchief and i sniff it like a drug addict I'm not a drug addict. I'm just saying. <laughs> um, I sniff it all the time. <coughs> and then <coughs> I have my Vicks um, inhaler right here for when my nose is clogged and I can't properly breathe. And then I shift my pillows everywhere. And this one's very helpful because my back hurts like 24-7. Then I just have another mask over there, earphones, and um, my old phone there, and my boyfriend's sleeping right now. So, yeah, um, <coughs> uh, I'm gonna rest because I feel like my fever is going back, and you know when you have a fever and your breath is just hot like whenever you're breathing it's just like i don't know it just feels hot when you're exhaling um and it feels like your entire body is like boiling um and my eyes feel like they're steaming and whenever i cough it feels like sand <coughs> sandpaper
and when he would be faced with a creature of rage and wrath. Ilya shuffled the cards and then dealt them. Four cards each and one face up in the middle. He picked up the olive pit and shuffled it between his hands before holding both fists out to Anton. Choose. Warily, Anton pointed at the left hand. Ilya opened it. said you don't taste the ginger I can taste it mm. my dad bought me strepsils I prefer the um cherry flavor but they didn't have that so we'll go with honey and lemon and more cough drops for me Hello, I just woke up and my hair styled itself, I guess. Okay, let's go out because I hear there's some food. What's going on? What's going on? Okay, we're gonna have veggie lasagna for dinner. <laughs> so this is tonight's dinner. Veggie lasagna. <coughs> So let's get the um, PM stuff in. So we got a tumbler from our neighbor. This is 24 ounces. I don't know how much is 24 ounces, but um, this is exactly what I needed. So thank you neighbor um our neighbor is a chef and he cooks for like filming crews actors and all that so they're filming firefly lane season two so there you go i got some merch <laughs> so i'm gonna fill this with ginger tea because i plan to drink a lot of those because my mom said um she's using that as her water and she's a lot better now, so I'm gonna copy her so I can be a lot better too. Why are you there? Why are you there? You shouldn't be here, I'm sick. Okay. Hello, good afternoon. It's Friday already. I did not vlog much yesterday. I was gonna say last week. Yesterday because I was really sick and I just stayed in bed and I ate and I was coughing so much so I just I had no energy to do anything else so I just <laughs> Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I just rested and today I also filmed my skincare morning skincare routine um, for spring just because I showered and I wanted some content I was like why not do a skincare routine so I filmed that so I will try to edit that tonight maybe so I can put it up tomorrow morning or evening maybe but I'm not really sure, it depends on my body, like I don't want to schedule anything um, because, you know, I'm sick and my body's just like, Ugh. Anyways, uh, I'm going to eat lunch, it's 14.41 right now, but I'm gonna eat lunch so I can, it's a late lunch, so I can take my meds and um, go from there. I'm eating Subway with this sauce, I don't know what this is, but this is definitely the sweet onion because that's my favorite. 
So that's my lunch for today. Ito mga araw na malakas yung katawan mo kahit 2-3 hours para makawag. Ba'y talaga ni Felicia? Can you bring me ano? What? Ganun. Kutsa, tinidor at saka kutsidyo? Yeah, please. Hindi lahat ng tao ganun kabayat. Yes, please! So yeah, my mom was just talking about her boss being nice. I'm trying to taste the food because last night I was early this morning. It was like 3 a.m., 4 p.m. I mean, 3 and 4 a.m. Um, I made kimchi fried rice and I ate and I couldn't really taste much. It was like eating, like you can, you, you feel the texture, but you don't really taste anything. And it was supposed to be spicy too, but like the spice isn't even there that much. Like I can feel it, but just a little bit. So I was wondering if I've already lost my sense of taste or something like that. Um, and right now, I don't, I don't know if I can taste it or not. So, but I'm just gonna eat it. But I don't feel like I can taste like 100%. Maybe it's at like 60% right now or something like, or maybe even less because I can't. See, like it's just. I need it. This one I can taste a little bit like a little but but yeah like I can feel like the spice here in my throat. Um but yeah, it's okay, I'm just I'm just gonna eat it and chill for now and then we'll see what I'll Persimmon right here. This is overripe, but I like it that way. So that's what I have. And I also got some Amazon patches that I'm gonna be opening. This is one of my favorite fruits. My Amazon package just came and um, these are the things that I got. First I have the eucalyptus oil because I ran out of uh, the eucalyptus oil. I love it. I'll put like a couple drops of this in my humidifier so I can like smell the, the minty. Plus the uh, peppermint oil, and then this one. Oops. This one is the Hydrosense Ultra Congestion Relief. Um, looks like that, and I think I'm supposed to like poke it because I think it's sealed. So let me just Apply one spray of Hydrosense Nighttime Congestion Eucalyptus in each nostril at night by depressing the nozzle for one second, followed by blowing off the nose for desired relief. 
okay Feels very. I think. I I don't know if that worked. Next thing is, Chloraseptic Max, temporary sore throat relief. And then this one is the Organica B Propolis um, spray. It relieves sore throat, it says. It's another throat spray. Let's try this because I feel like it won't be, it won't taste bad. Why is it brown, brother? Sorry, my phone died. But um, the rest are just these salon pads. Um, pads. And then I have the Spy Family Volume 7. The rest are still um, yet to be delivered. You can smell it. Oh! Ow! I know you can smell it. I'm alright now. I'm alright. I nearly drowned. Your day dinner, brother. Your day dinner. Your day. Oh, I didn't expect it. Oh. Oh. Hi, so I can't believe it's already a Sunday and it's one. F one. No, it's not one. It's 12 or 1 a.m. Um, I haven't eaten dinner yet, so I'm gonna eat now. I have a really bad. like a really bad headache right now. I don't know why. So after this, I'm going to take some meds and then rest and then hopefully I'll feel better when I wake up tomorrow. This is what I'm eating. It's just kimchi fried rice with eggs on top. Uh, you know, it doesn't look very appetizing, but it's actually really good and it's quite spicy because I am losing my sense of taste and I just need it spicy so it feels like I'm actually eating something that's like that's not super bland i'm also drinking calamansi juice because um i prefer this actually over the lemon i used to think another wasted night but not anymore Hello, happy Sunday. This is my brunch for today. It's the whole yay. Bon appetit. So, ordered Indian food. We have rice at home, so that's our rice. And this one is the aloo gobi, which is potatoes and cauliflower with spices. And then we have 
butter chicken as well. Then I have my tea over here and my water. Bon appetit! It's a rippling black smoke to bring the age of dark to yield. Meanwhile, he was so excited. He could not move, could not think, could not see anything but his eyes. Eyes of cold flame and light. Or break the world entire. His eyes gazing blankly up at a cloudless sky. Got a package, and I'm gonna open it. Right, Pepe. Right, Pepe. I don't know why it's so squished like that. Not sure what this is, but I think it's the washer tapes that I ordered. Oh, sorry, sorry, baby. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay, yeah. These are the stickers that I bought. Ta -da. Oh, wow. Um, because you know me, I love stickers. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's because you're very close. And I have washi tapes as well. So I'm really happy. Yay! Hi, hello. Today is the 22nd of May and as of today I am COVID free. I am already negative, thank god. So we're all done with the coughing and the sore throat and the nasal congestion, runny nose and fevers and just not being able to breathe properly or eat. My sense of taste is coming back which is also good. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm done with COVID and I am negative according to the test. I'm coughing a little bit but it's technically like gone gone but like you know I guess the body's just kind of clearing up the rest of the mucus whatever is still left. Anyways um, I just want to end the vlog with um, the six-ish books that I read uh, mostly listened to when I was sick so I'm not going to do like a review review ish of the um, the books I'm just gonna kind of like discuss it a little bit first book that I read this is not in particular order because I can't like I don't remember the order that I read them but the first one um, is there will come a darkness by Katie Rose pool it's a fantasy story and 
I loved it a lot. There's like six characters. One's like a prince. There's like a the Order of the Last Light guard. There's like a group of guard ish that has like a prophecy thing, and then there's like a the Pale Hand, which is a, an assassin killer, and then there's a girl who's sick, and then there's a prince. Did I already say that? There's a prince, and then there's someone who's like running away from something. Um, <clears throat> is there five or six of them? I don't know, but it's like. It's really good. I enjoyed it a lot. I love the audiobook as well. Um, and I have actually already downloaded the book two audiobook on my Libby app because I'm planning to. I just, I just really enjoy the story a lot. I uh, like the writing style. So I am going to actually listen to the second book right after this. I guess right after I finish editing the vlog and upload it on YouTube. And then the second book I will discuss is British Souls by V. Schwab. It's like a children, middle grade um, book, which is the third book in the series. The first one is City of Ghosts. The second one is Tunnel Tunnel of Bones, I think. So the third one is Bridge of Souls. It just continues the story. Is it moving? It just continues the story of Jacob and 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 i forgot her name cassie oh my goodness i forgot her name cassidy blake yes yeah that <clears throat> so loved it a lot love the audiobook as well and it's like horror ish but not really because it's middle grade so that's the only kind of like horror kind of genre that i can tolerate i guess like i can't actually like read actual horror horror books that are for adults read it once um <clears throat> when i was 12 i think 11 or 12 i borrowed a horror book from my friend and um yeah i regretted it and i'm not doing that again because it's just like when you read it it's so vivid that you can actually imagine everything you can see everything in your head and it's just Okay. Anyways, um, the uh, There Will Come a Darkness book is 4.5 out of 5. Bridge of Souls is also 4.5 out of 5. And then the third book is um, Homebody by Rupi Kaur. Um, this one is just the poetry book, which is a 4 out of 5. And then the fourth one is also a poetry book, which is called Dog Songs by Mary Oliver. It's just cute poems about dogs it's just some are really heartfelt some are sad some are just cute so 4.5 out of 5 and the two books that i read this week are diary of a young girl by anne frank which is a 5 out of 5 and then the other one is girl who fell beneath the sea by axio and that one is also a 5 out of 5 so those are all the six i think six books that i read when I was sick with COVID, at least I, you know, even when I was resting, I was listening to audiobooks, which is really good. Um, so yeah, I'm COVID free and I read six books. So I'm already editing and I didn't realize that I forgot to talk about Spy Family. I was watching the anime and I realized I wanted to buy all of the published uh, currently published manga volumes of Spy Family because I didn't want um, to wait for the anime to finish airing so I actually have got up to the latest um, chapter of the manga so that's where we are and uh, yeah so that's not six books that's actually not even seven because there's like seven published seven or eight I don't even know um volumes so that's about 13 or 14 books read in the past i don't know two and a half weeks so yeah that's just a little um extra clip <laughs> and now i'm healthy again i'd say and so yeah i will end the vlog here thank you for watching if you got to this part and uh, um, please like, comment, and subscribe only if you want to. I'm not forcing you and I will see you in my next video. Have a great day. Goodbye.